Avo, brand I haven't come back to in a long time. Uh, the Synchro line, several versions. This is the uh, Green Bay. Never had this one. Um, this is a Dominican wrapper, Ecuadorian uh, binder, and then Dominican and Nicaraguan fillers. So we'll see what happens. It's not listed as a very strong cigar, but not listed as a weak cigar. I think it's listed as a medium plus. So we'll see what happens. They had in three sizes. I chose the middle here being Toro. Um, it's got a pretty full pack. Uh, Dominican wrapper. It's quite a dark Dominican wrapper. We don't know. I don't know what uh, type of wrapper it is. I don't know if it's a shed wrapper that's used on a, on a let's say, uh, a Davidoff. I, you know, really, I don't know. Um, price point in Florida, $13. Booster was like 50 cents cheaper. So we'll find out. Wow, what do you know? Great construction, great burn, gonna drop you that ash. Um, great burn, great construction. Great job. The cigar, two to the box. Yeah, it's about a medium, medium plus. Probably a little stronger if you get the reboost though. And, and, and I'm not mad about that because it wasn't like it was advertised as a full strength cigar. I'm not some like full strength snob that like, Unless it's full strength, I'm not going to like it. But the profile on this, I don't know what the fuck. I don't know what the fuck they're trying to do. The cigar has a very dry feel to it. Not a long or heavy finish really at all. It, it, it feels about maybe 60, 65 percent darkness, so not really a dark cigar. That doesn't bother me. But it. it, it it's, just, it's a nutty cigar, but it's a very dry nutty, like dry nuts. I, I, I don't like that. It's not like a salted nuts or uh, caramelized honey type of nuts or a really nice type of cashew. Um, it's dried fucking nuts. There's a slight bit of cream to it, but it, it's a very short. Every Everything it has on it, 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 it doesn't doesn't do it i don't know man I, honestly this cigar is going to be this cigar is going to be like a 4.2 you know great construction great draw great burn the price point oh well i mean you could say oh well these are from i guess um between 10 and 13 dollars depending on the size that's in florida so more where you're at at that price point yeah there are lfds and my father's and other brands um even like the core lines of uh, Pacencia is the cheaper ones that I'd rather have. Um, even like a Fuente Hemingway, you know, like a like a signature size or a um, work of art size or something. I don't know. The point is though, um, I, I didn't connect with the cigar. I don't like the message of the cigar. It, all the flavors are short and dry. Is it a bad cigar? No, no, it, it works, it operates, and it, it's not a piece of shit, but I just don't like it. And that now I can say, well, it's preference. Yes, but also outside of preference, I don't know how I'd recommend this cigar. Hey, you want a cigar with not a lot of flavor? That's smooth, but not a lot of flavor? It's smooth, and it, and it works well, but not a lot of flavor? Did I mention it's got, it doesn't have a lot of flavor? You don't like that. Why? Why? Um, why? What? Why? It's got a little bit of cedar, but not that much. Everything that it has, it's like reserved, and it's like I don't know. For a Dominican uh, rapper. And Dominican fillers uh, with Nicaraguan fillers and an Ecuadorian binder. I don't know. I, I I think in my head it would have just would have been more. Of, I know it's not an explosive cigar, but it just would have been. But it had a little more pop to it, a little more. It has a very mild spice. Almost none. So it is what it is. Um. It's another avo that. Uh, 
man. I'm not saying this is bad tobacco. I'm not saying it's bad construction at all. What I'm saying is with this blend in this size, because you, you can just have a medium strength cigar like a Hemingway. That's still exciting. Uh, this is not exciting at all. And it's, it's hard for me to talk about the virtues of the flavor of this cigar. I won't lie to you though. So construction, draw, burn, everything else, great, groovy. Who gives a shit? There's a mild note of like honey. So it, it, it's got some complexity in some ways, but all the notes are like so diminished. So fucking diminished that, um, I don't know. Anyways, we're done here. I'd probably pass on this cigar. It's still 4.2 strong points being construction. Wow, great, it operates. I just held the smoke for like 10 fucking seconds and really like, my mind's like, well, what's going on? What's there? Like, even if cigars aren't strong, when we hold the smoke, you can see what, God damn, this is, this cigar's kind of sad. Yeah, I, I would probably, I'd probably pass on this. Yeah, it is what it is. Fuck Chio.